Hey everyone, Adam here, welcome back. Uh, so as you can see, as we're on the transfer window, we have made another loan signing, uh, Josh Bailey. He's only in as cover for the two centre-backs. Uh, he's on loan until the end of the season and he's from Bristol Rovers. So just a quick look back at the games since the video uh, with Weymouth and Gosport. So we drew 0-0 away at Welling. Uh, we beat Hastings 4-1 in the FA Cup at home. Scorers for that game was Dublu, uh, Dush Bailey and Talaji Bola. We put four in against Hemel as well. Uh, scores on that one were Asante, Joel Wollison and Rio Glean. Uh, Rio getting a, a red card as well. And there was a one all draw against Chelmsford. Joel Wollison scored another goal. But we did concede a very, very late penalty uh, in that game. Which gave us the one all. So what we'll do, we'll go have a quick look at the team I'm going to be putting out against Bognor Regis. And then we'll get into that game. So I am going with a slightly rotated team here. Uh, I am bringing back Hadler. And also bringing in Jake Giddings. So let's get into the game. Little Blue uh, taking the free kick, taking the kick off there. Rollinson with the ball. Passes it to Anson back to Rollinson. Found Allen out on the left, but couldn't quite find Pollock there. Bogomir just taking a free kick. Bailey with the clearing header. Double. Finding Giddings, he's found Rollinson. And it's straight to the keeper. Alan T to take the free kick. Bailey. Oh, that was close. Alan to take the free kick. Bogner with the throw in. I think they tried playing on to someone, but there's no one there. Hobson there now with the ball. Pass out to Giddery. Lovely. Try to find Bobby Pollock there. Rollinson with the ball. Finds and Dovely. Rollinson wins the ball there. Pollock. And it's straight to the keeper. Bogner picking up a yellow card. Giddery going to take the throw in to Giddings. Giddery keeps the ball in. Oh, that was really dangerous. Bailey with the ball now. Passing it back to Hadler. Just taking his time. Passes out to Bailey. Swan with the ball now. Bailey hoofing it up to Pollock. Plays it to, to Dovely. Anderson finds Ben Allen who tries to find Pollock. It wasn't quite in the right place. 
Robinson with the ball. Plays it to W. Giddings and it's straight to the keeper. Second yellow for Bogner. And that is it for the first half. Bogner taking the kickoff. Buckland, I don't know who he was searching for there, but he was miles away from anyone. Buckland making the first changes. Kiddery there with the ball. Finds Giddings. It's been brought down and it is a penalty. <laughs> Lovely to take the penalty. Come on, score. And he sends the keeper the wrong way and it ends up in the back of the net. This is fourth goal of the season. And he's balling now 1 0 up. Well taken penalty that. Give it a couple more minutes and I'll make a sub. Bogan made all of their subs now. Sub time. All right, let's bring Boyd on for Pollock. Yeah. There we go. To a triple sub. Having a beating Worthing 6 1. That's another local derby. There's so many local derbies. Oh, it's just over by Glean. I say about local derbies, but then we've got Blythe versus Braintree. <laughs> Can't really get much further away than that. Wilson on the pressure with the Bogner player. Giddery now sending it up, but there's no one there. Swan tried to get the ball, but it didn't quite get there. And the ball goes out for a Bogner throw in. Bogner taking the goal kick. Kiddery with the ball. Not too sure what that was, but the keeper's cleared it. And that is full time. It's a 1 0 win to Eastbourne. So through to the fourth qualifying round. We'll do. We'll do the FA Cup draw, and then we'll come back at some point for the second game. Right, we're here for the fourth round qualifying draw. Let's see who we get. Ideally, we want a lower team.
don't fancy going up to Blythe for you. Barney and St Albans, that's another Truro. Can't be that many more teams left. Oh, actually, there are quite a few by the looks of it. It's going to be. Oh, South Shields, no. Be away at Woking, and they're in the division above. So that's who it's going to be away at Woking. Could have done with a home tie, really. So I know we played Slough a few times last season, so I'll skip over that game and I'll go straight into the game against Woking. So we did manage to beat Slough 2-0 in the league. Uh, goals by Callum Anderson and Ewan Pollock. Let's go and have a quick look at the team we'll be going with for the game against Woking. And then we'll get into the game. And this is the team that I'll be going with for the game against Woking. Woking with the kickoff, Keeping it in their midfield at the moment. So, when does everyone reckon the beta will drop for FM21? Uh, Miles did say it will be about two weeks before full game launch. So, I reckon it will probably be out on... I don't want to go exactly two weeks. So, let's say the 9th of November. Working with the ball. Warbent with the ball now. Passing it out to Glean out on the left hand side. He's got past his man, but he couldn't get past the keeper. Working now taking a free kick just inside of our half. And Giddery clears the ball. Only as far as a working player though, who brings it back into the box. Giddery now clearing it. Well, we just can't keep possession at the moment. Every time we kick a ball, it goes to a working player. Hobson clearing the ball there. Anderson out on the wing. Finds Pullock, but Pullock puts it over. Glean taking the corner kick. It's a head straight to their keeper. Working in another attack. Working still with the ball in the box. And Stahl puts that over for a corner. Didn't really have much choice there.
Stone punching the ball away. It must be in a tactic somewhere where we only take short goal kicks. Anderson getting the ball over to Rollinson. No one was there clean. Just about manages to keep that in. Pollock with the ball. And it's out for is it a corner? Yep, it's a corner. Clean to take the corner again. Santi. Oh, it's off the crossbar. A bit of pressure on working at the moment with these corner kicks. Anson to glean. It's over. We just want the goal to be a couple of inches taller and a couple of inches wider, I think. Ball bent, passing the ball to Glean. Make it a run forward. Pass it to the Pollock. Intercepted there. Now working on the attack. Oh, there's that. That's no card for you. Pollard taking the uh, throw in. Beat the tackle there, cleaning bit of space, but it's straight to the keeper. And that is the end of the first half. Santi with the kickoff. Back in defence, Hobson sends it forward to Asante, who heads it to ball bent. Pass to Anderson, pass straight over to Asante. It's back to Anderson. Rollinson heading up on the right hand side. Couldn't quite get the cross in there though. Hobson picking up a yellow there. Could be putting the ball into the box with Glean now. Oh. One can play just got in front of the ball there, deflect it out. Glean to take the corner. And that wasn't the best of corners, really. Is it throw in? Oh, it was offside anyway. Clean winning the ball there. Ball bent trying to find Pollock but doesn't quite find him. Santi now passing it back to Goodery. Hobson hoofing it up. That Ferguson player seems to be getting in front of everything in the game. Hobson. Pollock's in the box but he got tackled clean to take looks like it yep clean to take the corner woken get the ball away 
so well out of his area there. Tried to find Glean, a working player, intercepted. Santi in a bit of space now. Finds Glean is in more space. And he shoots and it's in! 64th minute goal by Glean. Look at that through ball into plenty of space. Keeper gets his fingertips to it, but it's not quite enough to stop the goal. Working, making a couple of subs, and we'll do our subs in this moment as well. Let's do the subs now, ready for the next break of play. Void on for Pollock. I don't want to take Glean off. I don't want to put him over on the right either. Defence. Let's put. Who's got the lower condition? If he's got the lower condition, let's bring Statham on. And Bailey as well for Hobson because he's got a yellow. And that's it. I'm probably going to regret changing both defenders. Oh no. Thirty yard screamer. Well, that didn't last long. Do I want to? Uh, no. Let Robinson take this. Oh, it's just wide. It's not going to do it for that, is it? that'll do for that and then I'm gonna when I can Let's Tactics as well. Working, making their last substitution as well. Look at that formation. Four one five. They went down the middle, but there's no one there. And it's off the post, and Bolo clears it to safety. Working to take the corner. Boyd with the header get, manages to get it out of the box, but not into his safety, but Wallison ensures it is put out to safety there. Free kick taken, and it's wide. It's going to be a goal kick. Four minutes of time added on. Working with the ball, and it's locked. It's 
going to be a corner to Woking. Come on. Don't concede now. Woking still with the ball in a dangerous area. And that's it. It is going to be a replay down at Priory Lane. What we'll do for the next video is we'll come back practically straight away. We'll do the FA Cup first round draw. Uh, we won't do the replay though. What we'll do is we'll either come back for the FA Cup first round or we'll come back for the game against Haven. So hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, please leave a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications. And I'll catch you all soon. Bye.